morning started off great. I'm getting all hyped. The Ravens showing these different players uh, come out for training camp and the fans are there. They getting all excited. So they get me even more excited than I already was. Then I'm over here thinking about the open practice this coming Saturday. I'm like, oh, man, I can't wait. And just so much excitement and, and emotion, too, because I told you on Twitter, I, got, I even got a little teary eye like seeing that because we're back. We're finally back, man. But somebody who's not back is Lamar Jackson. Jameson Hensley and Jeff Zrebic, they both had tweeted out that Lamar Jackson wasn't at practice yet. So I'm thinking, oh, okay. Ravens did say, they did come out and say they want to get the deal done before training camp. Training camp starts today, and with Lamar having not partaken in training camp yet, and with him being back in the building, hey, timing is everything, right? And with him scheduled to speak to the media... After practice today, I'm like, oh, yeah, what better way? What better setup? It only makes sense that he's signing his new deal. He's getting his bread. He's getting a new contract. So then I had said that. Then I saw some other people start talking about it. So I'm hyped off of it. And, I, and just thinking about the possibility of Lamar getting paid, I'm like, man, I ain't even worried about Baker Mayfield. I ain't even worried about Josh Allen and none of them boys. Lamar getting ready to get his bread. So then <laughs> Adam Schefter. <laughs> oh, Adam Schefter, gift and a curse, because he breaks all the news. He said, Lamar Jackson is not practicing today in a COVID-related case. The league is still trying to process. Per Jameson Hensley and me, Jackson, who tested positive on Thanksgiving, had another test that NFL officials flagged. NFL now going through science and Ravens awaiting answers. Now, okay, first... Let me just get this out of the way before we talk about this. What did the, 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 the whole thing about Thanksgiving had to do with now? That was back in, what, November? And, what, like, what does that got to do with now? Anyway, like, I, I, I feel like that part was pointless to bring up. I don't, anyway, so Lamar Jackson, they, they didn't say whether he got it, whether he was around somebody that got it, whether he was a close contact, whether they got to do contract tracing. Everything right now on the whole situation is very uh, just... Hush, hush. It's a lot more questions than answers right now. So we just, they, they, we, we don't know what's going on. We don't know. Um, but they did say that Trace McSorley and um, Tyler Huntley going to take the majority of the reps. I know Jeff Zrebick talked about, um, not Kenyon Barner. What's the, the quarterback that uh, they had him last year? Ah, uh, the name is not coming to me right now, and it's taking too long to find it. But And they, they, they had another quarterback out there as well. But Lamar Jackson is not out there. So now his status uh, is up in the air. We, of course, saw with Gus Edwards. They said Gus Edwards tested positive yesterday, so he's going to miss the first 10 days of training camp. Uh, so that would remove him from, obviously, this week. Uh, that would remove him from the open practice to everybody. So now with Lamar Jackson, depending on what it is, the same thing could end up happening. Now, again, this is one of those a bittersweet thing because bitter, obviously, because Lamar Jackson is out. Every single rep that he takes with all the receivers and whatnot, the tight ends, the running backs, everybody, the offensive line, it makes them that much better. But, you know, Lamar Jackson knows the stuff. Uh, he's going to be good to go when he does come back. Now, that's the bitter part, of course. And then, of course, him not being there with the fans and stuff for the practices that they go into and the training camp uh, the, and the, the open practice on Saturday and all that. He's, he, could, he could possibly not be at those. It's not set in stone. But the, the sweet part, I guess, uh, is that with Tyler Huntley and Trace McSorley, they get more reps. Um, but this is not the way we wanted them to get more reps. This, this, this definitely was not it. Uh, so, I mean, we'll see what happens. Again, nothing set in stone. Uh, and, of course, I'm, I'm sure we'll be doing another update video later on when this whole thing becomes a lot uh, more clear. So, team, keep it clean. Appreciate y'all. I love y'all. And, unfortunately, uh, just like Lamar Jackson is today, when it comes to training camp practice, I'm out.